The Site Catalyst and Test and Target integration for us started back when we uh, realized that we needed to, to optimize our website. Uh, the more that we can influence the bottom of our conversion funnel, uh, the greater return we can have. In doing so, uh, we engaged with an agency to begin with, quickly realized this is something we could bring in-house and do and, and, and iterate much more quickly uh, and progress from there. Uh, I think it was a natural progression for us as we saw, hey, there's a baseline we can set and we're kind of competitive, so we thought, can we improve upon that? And so that's where the test and target piece came in. Some of the tests we run with test and target, a recent one in fact, uh, is a conversion funnel flow test uh, where we've tested three different version of our, versions of our conversion funnel against our control. Uh, one that was really Ajax heavy, uh, thinking, hey, this is kind of glammy, it, it looks really good, uh, our customers are going to love that. Uh, another one, we shortened the process down from a five-step process to a three-step process, and another was kind of a hybrid of the two. Uh, we quickly realized, just getting into the test almost a week, that our Ajax version wasn't liked by our customers. Uh, they really didn't like it at all. Uh, so we actually were able to stop that test and continue on with the other two variations or recipes against our control. Uh, pretty soon we realized that the, the combination of the two didn't work either, and so we were able to just test uh, the one, the three-step version, against our control uh, and have been able to see some great lift from it. Double-digit lift in not only revenue, but also conversions, which is a huge win for us, uh, again, looking at the bottom of the funnel.